This is Carl Quinciliani here, working on a dragon. Yo, YouTube. Carl's a street artist. He's been painting in St. Pete for 10 years, for those that don't know. And I've been documenting his work. He's been working on a lot of projects this year. Lots of stuff to be, be released soon. Good, huh? Yeah. Can I see what it looks like on that? Space. Yeah. We turn the back of it into a little chamber where we can charge people to go in it. Everything in there will be 3D from the floor to the walls to the ceiling. You know what I mean? It'll be a chamber that they'll go, what the fuck, and they'll want to leave, but they won't leave because it's cool. You know what I mean? We'll make it so 3D and they're walking on the floor, they'll feel like they're sinking into the floor. I know, listen, look at how I draw this. These are foot pounds. They're not gonna be able to really tell because the floor is going to be black, okay? And this is a foot trap, but it's going to sink because the sides are going to be red, the center is going to be red, and it's going to make them feel like they're going down into the floor. As they're walking on it, they won't be able to tell that it's just flat on the ground. 
do another one right beside it. It's actually a toilet paper roll. <laughs> That's right, I thought it looked yeah. like. But it'll sink into the ground the way that it's drawn out with the light. You know what I mean? It's got to be dark, though. It's got to be. You're talking about having that on the sides of the walls? No, I'm talking right, right on the floor. On the walls, you can make the corners spin so badly that people won't even be able to look at it. They go, what? And their eyes will go nuts. But that's like with graffiti. We'll make like this stuff into graffiti into the corner and wrap the corners right around. Yeah, I'll hold on to them. Okay, take some of them. I need to put some in my pocket. Here. 